10 tactics to help us survive the end of days tribulation. Many Christian believers will not survive the terrible three and a half years that are to come upon the earth before Jesus return. Here is a call for the endurance of the saints, those who keep the commandments of God, and their faith in Jesus. Blessed are the dead who die in the Lord from now on. Whilst others will indeed endure to the end of those terrible years and the dead in Christ will rise first. Then we who are alive, who are left, will be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. Jesus himself announced several warnings and instructions. The New Testament of the Holy Bible provides us with ample instructions on how Christian believers may survive the end times. 10. Pray to find daily food. Your Father knows what you need. Pray then like this, our Father in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Deliver us from evil. 9. Pray that you may escape. Stay awake at all times, praying that you may have strength to escape all these things that are going to take place, and to stand before the Son of Man. 8. Remain ready to flee. You will be hated by all for my name's sake, but the one who endures to the end will be saved. When they persecute you in one town, flee to the next. 7. Accept help from anyone. Whoever gives one of these little ones even a cup of cold water because he is a disciple, will by no means lose his reward. Jesus' apostles wrote other warnings and instructions. 6. Do not be seduced by fake miracles. The coming of the lawless one is by the activity of Satan, with all power and false signs and wonders, and with all wicked deception. 5. Pray to be delivered from the evil one. Pray for us that we may be delivered from wicked and evil men. But the Lord is faithful. He will establish you and guard you against the evil one. 4. We keep ourselves from false religion. He who was born of God protects him, and the evil one does not touch him. Keep yourselves from idols. The ancient scriptures also provide us with survival tactics. 3. Migrate if you can. Arise, and depart with your household, and sojourn wherever you can, for the Lord has called for a famine, and it will come upon the land for seven years. 2. Expect miraculous provision of food. She and her household debt for many days. The jar of flour was not spent, neither did the jug of oil become empty, according to the word of the Lord. Finally, Jesus left us with an amazing promise for all time. 1. Keep seeking God's kingdom. Do not be anxious, saying, What shall we eat? Or what shall we drink? Or what shall we wear? For your heavenly Father knows that you need them all. But seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things will be added to you. You may have already perceived that these same ten tactics apply to those who suffer persecution in the present age.